The next step for our built-in closet is putting all these little trim pieces on. Now this is a pretty tedious job. You need a carpenter that knows this stuff. But just for example, all this trim in here only took about five hours for one guy. He came in here, measured everything, and again, we had plans built ready to go. And what this does, this trim, it hides all the connections between our very affordable high density fiber board and this actual front face that is real wood. What we've also come done is come in here and just nailed it with little pin nails. Now these little pin nails are almost invisible and we'll just patch them up with a little bit of compound, sand them flush, and then this all gets sprayed a pure white and we usually use a Sherman Williams product that is meant for doors, moldings, and cabinets. And it's a super hard, glossy finish. It just looks fantastic. Looking behind me here, you can see we have two full height areas that are gonna have bars on them where you can hang dresses, coats, um, suits, you name it. And then around the whole entire thing here, we got six more areas that are gonna be long enough to hang shirts and pants and everything like that. If you were moving to this house, let me know in the comments what you think about this design. If you think there's anything that we can add it for a future house or anything we should throw in in this house before we put it on the market. I'd love to know your comments because this is just a very entry level, easy to produce, affordable closet system. It might not have all of the bells and whistles of some of those bigger brands out there. Now that the trim is put on, everything's been filled, sanded, and painted, you can see how this really came together. This is an absolutely awesome bomber closet system that's gonna stand up, be very stable, no uh, low density fiber board, nothing that's gonna fall apart or feel cheap, and it serves its function. And the biggest thing is that this cost us probably a quarter of what you'd pay for one of the big box, you know, out west closet stores. Once a little bit of hardware is installed in here, you'll be able to see how this really came together and provides an awesome solution that adds a couple thousand in value to this house. It's something that this clientele will expect to have, or it's something they'll have to do themselves, and it'll be a great selling point when people come and look at this house. Thanks again for joining, guys. I hope to provide a ton of content in future videos just like this on showing you what you need and what you don't need when you consider different items for building a new house or renovating your own. This system is just one of the many things that the builder here has really found a way to do efficiently and do well. Stick around if you got value out of the video, definitely subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below if there's anything you wanna see in future videos. Thanks for joining, I'll see you guys next time.